Hello, I'm Emma. Welcome to my tutorial on free motion. We so far we've looked at stippling and we've looked at stippling with added decoration stars and hearts. Today we're going to do the basic wiggly line. It can be used as a single line or you can then cross it so you get a check pattern. Very simple. I will show you how to do it. So again, my machine is set up with the feed dogs dropped, free motion foot applied, and I'm running on tension of number six today, but that might just vary on everybody's machine. Just feel free, play around with your machine until you get your tensions just as you need them. Okay, I'm just gonna do very gentle movements, as you'll see. So we're just doing straight lines, wiggly lines in a straight line. And they don't have to be perfect. And when you get to the bottom, just move across and you go back on yourself. You can have it so it mirrors the previous line exactly if you need to, or you can have it so it's slightly different. Again, it's a choice of yours and what you're doing with how you want your quilt to look. aren't perfect but they don't have to be on these last few just to show you that you don't have to have it dead straight. And the fabric I'm using is just basic fabric, basic fabric sandwich with some batting in the middle. At the end I've just done it. Here we go. So that one I've just done. Some quite tight wiggly lines. So as you can see not perfect but on a quilt that looks absolutely fine on the next one I will be showing you how to cross that well, cross this one uh, so you have a like a, a cross effect please join me for the next video thank you for watching